If you found this video, you are probably bringing your experience from another programming language and want to know how to create private attributes in Python classes. I will show you how some developers prefix class attributes with underscores and call them private. But are they really private? Nope. And I will show you that private attributes are not possible in Python. Look at this code. Class employee takes two parameters, name and salary. I create an employee and print the name and salary. As you can see, the name and salary can be accessed. They are public. There is a convention in Python to indicate that variables are private by prefixing them with underscores. I'll first use a single underscore. Looks like it's working. Python raised an attribute error. But what if I prefix the salary here as well? Ok, you have learned the first lesson from this tutorial. Prefixing an attribute with a single underscore does not make it private. It is just a visual clue that the variable should not be accessed outside of the class. So what about prefixing the attribute with double underscores? And I'll use the new name in the print statement. Now something is different. Even if I use the exact attribute name in the print statement, Python still raises an attribute error. But the visibility of the salary attribute is still public. Let me show you all the names in the employee object. I'll explain in a moment why salary now has this strange name. For now, just notice it is still public. I'll demonstrate this. The value 2000 is shown. Prefixing a class attribute with double underscores causes name mangling. You just saw that prefixing class attributes does not change the attribute's visibility. All class attributes in Python are public. When you prefix attributes with double underscores, Python prefixes the name again with the class name. This is called name mangling, and its purpose is not to make attributes private, but to avoid clashes of names when using inheritance. Did you know this? Let me know in the comments. So what about a single underscore? Well, it doesn't change the visibility either. But at least users of the class get a visual clue that this attribute is not meant to be used from outside of the class. What is important for you to know is this. You can use no prefix, a single underscore prefix, or prefix the attribute with double underscores. But whatever you do will have no impact on the visibility of the attributes. You can read this yourself in the Python documentation. I'll put a link to it in the description. And that's all for this video. For more tips and tricks in Python classes, click one of my other videos. Thanks for watching.